What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some more news concerning Ryan Garcia, Julio Cesar Chavez. Get this. The legend, Julio Cesar Chavez, states that Ryan Garcia is a disgrace to the Mexican race. Wow. <laughs> uh, Julio Cesar Chavez said he's a disgrace to the Mexican race. He shouldn't call himself Mexican or nowhere near it. He quit on the canvas. And for that, you cannot be Mexican doing those type of things. And let me counterpunch. Let me tell you guys something, okay? It is hard for any uh, minority to uphold their race due to someone from that country. Um, Mexicans in particular, you know, they're not Mexican enough. They're not American enough. You know, so they're kind of stuck in the middle a lot of times. So they will get shit from Mexico, Mexicans from Mexico. And, you know, as far as Julio Cesar Chavez is concerned, he's a quitter and he's not Mexican. And my counterpunch to that is Ryan Garcia made a mistake. He made a mistake, but it, but he really revealed himself to everyone. He did quit. Um, should he be burned at the stake? Not necessarily, but should he be really put in his place? Yes, he should. Because Ryan had a choice, you know, and let's look at it in another way. All right. And this is something I never talked to you guys about. If it's one of those, it's one of those situations where it's people that want to continue that don't have the choice to continue. Certain fights, some fights, like the ones I complain about in the UK, they get stopped prematurely. Sometimes the doctor stops it. Sometimes the corner stops it. Sometimes. You know, um, you get knocked out cold. Ryan Garcia was none of that. Ryan Garcia could have continued. Now, I know getting hit in the liver, it's a body shot, it's different. But listen, it's up to you and your own will. You know, what you're willing to do. And Ryan just showed us he wasn't willing to do that. He wasn't going that extra step or above and beyond or any of that legendary shit. So, yes, he's a fighter and he's a decent fighter. OK, he's just very fast, but he quit. So, no, he didn't show the heart of what most Mexicans would do because most Mexicans would get up. See, Ryan Garcia, sad to say, he should have really thought long and hard before signing his line on that dotted line, on that signature, on that contract. He should have thought long and hard about it, you know. And see, it would have been better for him to get knocked out versus him just quit like he did. Because again, he could have then put himself in a situation similar to most people, you know, that couldn't pretend, you know, that was getting hit too much and not protecting themselves or, you know, got hurt or cut or whatever. You know what I mean? He didn't do either. Well, I seen him wince. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm figuring the shot hurt. I, I don't think he was faking. So for people that thought Orion was faking, that's a whole different story. No. I think Ryan Garcia just quit. Okay, and people don't respect that. How could you? You know what I mean? Based on the evidence that I explained, because there's some people that will fight to the death. You think they're going to respect you? You think Julio Cesar Chavez Sr. is going to respect you? And then seeing his son Jr. do something similar like that, quit? That's probably what it is, people. I think Julio Cesar Chavez seen a resemblance of what his son did versus what Ryan did. His son quit on the stool. Ryan quit because he took a knee. Okay? So that might be 
what what was triggering Julio Cesar Chavez, you know, but if it's not, that's enough by what Ryan did by quit. He quit. You know what I mean? He, he, he just, he, you know, he took that shot and listen, like, it was almost like the fight was just getting started. You know what I mean? And he showed no resistance. Your resistance, your durability at all is based on how big a heart you have, how big a will. How, how much dedication did you really put into this fight? You know, you agreed to all this shit, but you're just talking because that's just, you know, that's just signing despite what's against you. But what was really, truly against you was the fact that that pain hit you on the side of your fucking uh, body and you wasn't really to de willing to deal with it or you wasn't willing to continue dealing with it because that's what you would have been dealing with throughout that fight and possibly getting dropped again. When you got popped right in the fight face with a left hook. So Julio Cesar Chavez, is it warranted him being mad like that? Yes, because Ryan Garcia is supposed to be the future of boxing. And he showed that he quit. And somebody that quit cannot be the future of fucking boxing. I'm sorry. He cannot be. You know, guys like Arturo Gotti with even less skill than someone like Ryan Garcia. Less speed and all that shit didn't quit like that they had to stop it if anything but that shows who you truly are that's when you really have the juice and you respect or you get the respect that you deserve ryan won't get that and julio cesar chavez senior coming out coming forth and saying hey he doesn't deserve to be uh, labeled or named anywhere near us well you can't really argue with him because you know ryan decided to quit Showing that he was a quitter. Showing that he didn't have the heart. But that is what it is. You guys tell me what you think of Julio Cesar Chavez blasting Ryan Garcia for quitting. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been Counterpunch. Peace!